1986 was a special year for many reasons. Intel began manufacturing its latest microprocessor, the 386. Mike Tyson won his first ever boxing title and Haley's Comet swung by. The top movers of the year were Top Gun, Ferris Bueller's Day Off and of course, Crocodile Dundee. 1986 was marked with the birth of many famous names. Lindsay Lohan, the Olsen Twins, Lady Gaga, Drake and you guessed it, Haltech. The mid-1980s was an interesting time for the automotive industry. The advent of electronic fuel injection changed the way enthusiasts and racers built and tuned their cars. Within a decade, almost all new cars were manufactured with some type of EFI system. Hartec's first ECU, the F2, featured four fuel injector drivers and a fuel pump output. But the F2's real claim to fame was the ability to program the fuel maps in real time using a laptop computer an industry first and a technology that Howtech would eventually hold worldwide patents to. While it was groundbreaking in 1986, the F2 looks positively ancient compared to the Elite Series ECUs. It's like comparing one of the first mobile phones to today's modern smartphones. Today, Howtech makes over a hundred different products and has offices in Australia and the United States of America, which service over 50 countries around the world. Haltech is actively involved in motorsport through numerous sponsorships, product development, tech support and contingency programs. We also offer a wide range of after-sales support from training seminars and track support to our online tech videos and social media. So today, while we celebrate our 30th birthday, we would like to acknowledge all those who have contributed to our success. Our team, our dealers and distributors, our media partners, all our race teams, and last but not least, the people who over the years have purchased, used, and tuned Haltech products. You're all part of our success, and for that we thank you.